right, ladies and gentlemen, the recent partnership announcement between Shopify and YouTube has completely revolutionized the way of doing e-commerce. And it has also changed the direction which we should be taking our e-commerce brand in and the things that we should be focusing on. But exactly what is the reality behind this partnership? How is it going to benefit us e-commerce store owners, especially those, at least my audience, Google ads majority of the time? And is it going to really be a favorable change for a lot of us or not? Because yes, having another placement to sell your products on is perfect. It's exactly what we wanted, but there's a lot of extra things which come about when we have an option to now broaden our focus, broaden our approach towards selling with our e-commerce brand. Now, before we get into anything within this video, let's go over some key important characteristics that define YouTube. So I have this website opened up here. It is globalmediainsights.com. What I want to show you is some interesting YouTube statistics, which you should know and how this is going to impact us e-commerce store owners. So first things first, just in 2022, a record of 2.6 billion people. That's right. Billion with a B were using YouTube in a given month. That is a lot of people. Almost half of our world's population has access to YouTube. Now, does this mean that all of these people you can target and you can sell to? Not necessarily, because a lot of these people are in different countries. You might not sell to those countries, etc., etc. However, it doesn't change the fact that there's still a whole bunch of people out there watching YouTube. In addition, another thing you want to keep a close eye on is YouTube's global advertising revenue. So in 2021, this revenue amount was about $28.8 billion. So the reason why I'm kind of referring to that right now is this tells you that those people on YouTube don't necessarily just come on YouTube to just kind of watch the video and then leave. Some of them do end up taking some sort of action, which can contribute to this revenue amount right here, whether it's for YouTube or whether it's for another e-commerce brand. So that should let you know that those people on YouTube aren't just there to watch stuff. They are also there with a buying intent if the right opportunity comes to them. Now, originally, without this partnership, without these extra placements now that Shopify is offering, what we really needed to do was we needed to create a YouTube ad via our Google Ads account that would go out and we would need to do all this crazy targeting. We would need to have different kinds of ad copies and all sorts of stuff that came with running YouTube ads. And a lot of the times, it would just kind of be an extra addition to the overall expenses you already had to deal with. You would need to go out and hire somebody or maybe do it yourself, film a very nice video. And it was just a lot of extra hassle. And trust me, when I say this, I absolutely hate making those ad copies, especially when it has to do something with videos, because I just don't know what makes a good video ad copy. In Facebook, when I used to use Facebook ads often, I used to just rely on those image ads. And unfortunately with YouTube, we can't just put up an image ad and just have that do the work. So we need to do a video ad for that. But of course, that is really only something you have to do if you're trying to run those YouTube ads. On the other hand here, with this new partnership, you might not necessarily even have to run any sorts of ads with YouTube anymore. But in addition, one benefit that I really like with this kind of strategic approach to this partnership between Shopify and YouTube is now a lot of people who were once already running YouTube ads are going to have a lower ad spend in total. It comes to actually the Google ad side of things, because if they were targeting YouTube ads, they were running some YouTube ads campaigns, they don't necessarily have to do that any longer because they can just rely on their brand's YouTube channel to then sell all of their products. So it's sort of like a free connection now for those people who are just able to sell their products via their YouTube channel directly. And they can kind of reallocate that budget they had for YouTube ads, maybe to shopping ads, maybe they can watch some of my videos, or they can also do any other types of advertising. By the way, this is something that we have also started doing more for not only my e-commerce brands, but also my client's e-commerce brands under my Google Ads agency, Your Marketing, which if you're doing around $30,000 or more per month, you need a little bit of extra help scaling to the next level. Go on to my website at yourmarketing.com, book a free call with me to see how we can possibly work together. But let's kind of start talking about some of the basics of what this is bringing about when it comes to Shopify itself and what it means for us e-commerce store owners. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and open up this official page right here, which is a Shopify page that you can find all of Shopify's news here, where it goes over all of the different things that it's bringing about with this partnership. Now, keep in mind, I know that this partnership was kind of released a couple of weeks ago already, but the reason why I waited before making this video is I wanted to see if there were any types of extra benefits Shopify might be adding specifically for those people that are also using Google Ads. Right now, we were we are going to be covering most of the benefits which I see currently available via this partnership. So first things first, this program is now called the YouTube Shopping Program on Shopify. Basically, what this shopping program is, it gives you all of us e-commerce store owners the ability to integrate our online store with YouTube directly via our YouTube channel 
channel. So for example, if we go back to this link, if we look at what it says right here, we can see that it says press play on your sales because what's going to happen is all of our products will now be directly clickable in our YouTube video. So if we look at this right here, we can see those products coming up right below this YouTube video. So these are the products this person sells and that's the brand associated with their YouTube channel. That's exactly what a YouTube shopping program is now enabling you to do. But that's not all because if we now look at some of the other things, we can see that in addition to that on your mobile device, you can you have this live shop right here, which you can interact with, which your customers can directly click on and purchase while they're directly watching a video of yours, which I think was a really smart move. In addition, if you're, for example, doing some kind of live stream and there's a live chat going on, you can throw in a product right here and you can pin it at the very top of the live chat so that those customers that are currently within your chat can directly shop from this pinned post. So I think all of these options that YouTube has given us via the YouTube shopping program are really beneficial when it comes to getting those extra sales through our YouTube channels without really having to pay a single extra dime. But in addition, just to kind of recap as to what's going to be happening with this partnership, your customers will now be able to see every single product which you sell on your e-commerce brand directly at the bottom of your video or in some other way, shape or form. Now, this can be done through those live streams that you hold on your YouTube channel. This can also be done directly within the video. So every single video, you have the ability to connect your products to that given video and then have it showcased at the bottom. But in addition, you can have a full on store tab that will be added to your YouTube channel. And I think this is going to happen directly on your YouTube homepage. So for example, if I go on over to my YouTube channel, and by the way, be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And if we look at how my YouTube channel is currently laid out, we can see that this is how a current shopping tab looks. If we go inside this, once you apply your e-commerce brand to for this program, this program will now display a certain tab here called the shopping, where when somebody clicks on that shopping tab, for example, it will showcase all of your products that come up right here, which your customers can directly interact with, which I think is a really good move from YouTube and Shopify's end, because this kind of adds another layer of revenue for a lot of e-commerce brands out there, especially those with YouTube channels. But now that we kind of covered the basics, let's understand what this means for us e-commerce store owners, especially those running Google Ads. First things first, if you were looking for ways to expand your reach to your audience, well, now here you go. This is a perfect way for you to now start a YouTube channel for your e-commerce brand directly, get those subscribers coming in because not every new e-commerce brand with a YouTube channel can actually apply for this program. You need to follow certain criteria. But once you follow that certain criteria, you get to apply for this program and you get another source of revenue directly from YouTube. But in addition, it's really beneficial for you as a Google ads advertiser if you're scaling your brand with Google because now Google's algorithm will see that you are getting the links from YouTube going back to your own e-commerce brand and Google is going to detect this via Google's algorithm because again Google search networks YouTube is one of those search networks and Google can detect this this is going to add authority to your e-commerce brand so when you add authority to your e-commerce brand what happens is now you might not necessarily need to compete as much with another competitor who might not be on YouTube so you might be paying less to get a potential customer on your website compared to somebody else already not on YouTube. So this is really a big benefit for e-commerce store owners. And that's why I believe everybody currently trying to scale with their e-commerce brand and with Google applies for this YouTube program. Let's kind of cover how you can actually apply for this YouTube program, how you can get things rolling. So if you want a link to this directly on how to apply, let me know down in the comment section below, just comment and I will paste in this link for you. But all you need to do is you need to kind of add it to your store. So it tells you the steps. The first step is to install the Google channel in the Shopify app store. Once you install it properly, set it up, all of that good stuff in the YouTube shopping section of the Google channel, you need to connect your YouTube because without connecting the YouTube account, this is only for Google ads. You will not be able to do anything else with this until you do step number two. Once you do step number two, then it's on to step number two, three, which is choose which products to feature for YouTube shopping. So you can choose certain products. You can choose everything. It's up to you. And then you can add those products to your videos via the monetization section under shopping. So again, you need to kind of qualify for this. Not everybody is going to be able to do this. And if you read a little bit more right here, it will tell you what can be done. But also at the very top, it should tell you from a little bit of digging. I found out that only those YouTube channels currently monetized with YouTube have the ability to actually showcase their products on their YouTube channel. So if you are not monetized yet, you will need to post a few videos, get a little bit of traction, and then it should let you kind of apply for this option. However, this might change at any given time from when I record this video. But those are pretty much the only four steps you need to take in order to get your channel fully approved for products with your YouTube account. And that is pretty much it. But to kind of answer the main question of the video of what is the reality of this, the reality is you now have an extra channel to really showcase your
your e-commerce brand to really scale it further and i do think you should 100 percent take advantage of this those people not taking advantage of this are going to miss out long term not only from youtube sales but also from a boost in their overall google ad sales but again if you're doing thirty thousand dollars or more per month in revenue with your e-commerce brand you need a little bit of extra help scaling your e-commerce brand to the next level go on to my website at yourroommarketing.com and book a free call with me to see how we can possibly work together and scale your brand to the next level but if you found any type of value in this video make sure to destroy the like button destroy that subscribe button and i will see you in my next video